Madam Chair, distinguished delegates, I am honored to represent India and provide an overview of our nation's effort in tobacco control. India has made significant strides in aligning our policies with the WHO FCTC guidelines to curb tobacco demand as well as supply. India has played a pivotal role as a key facilitator in the working group on tobacco advertising, promotion, and sponsorship in entertainment media. We have also served as a member in various working groups and expert groups addressing issues such as implementation of Article 9 and 10 of the WHO FCTC, enforcement, information sharing, assistance, cooperation, and the elimination of illicit trade in tobacco products. India was also one of the countries which volunteered for the implementation review mechanism showcasing our commitment to global tobacco control. The global monitoring framework for NCDs aims to reduce tobacco prevalence by 15% by 2020 and 30% by 2025 from the 2010 baseline levels. India has already made significant progress, achieving the 2020 target with a 17.3% reduction in tobacco use as per the second GATS report of India. We are on track to achieve the 2025 global target if we maintain or accelerate our current pace of con tobacco control measures. The Indian government has actively implemented measures to reduce the consumption of various tobacco products, including cigarettes, BDs, and smokeless tobacco. We have also made substantial strides in implementing WHO FCTC Articles 9 and 10, establishing four tobacco testing laboratories, which are also a part of WHO's tobacco laboratory network. And these laboratories play a central role in generating evidence for policy change. Moving forward in the direction of product regulation, we have set up two specialized groups of experts, namely the Na National Tobacco Regulators Forum and the Scientific Support Group, housed at Premier Medical Institutes of India to provide direction, recommendations, and guidelines in shaping effective policies and regulations. India has also re resolutely instituted a comprehensive nationwide ban on electronic cigarettes in 2019. This ban encompasses all categories of electronic nicotine delivery systems, heat not burn products, e-hookers, and similar devices. India's unwavering dedication to preserving public health continues to guide us in adapting proactive measures aimed at mitigating the escalating prevalence of vaping, particularly among the younger generation. India has also made notable progress in regulating tobacco advertising, promotion, and sponsorship in line with Article 13 of the WHO FCTC, especially in the realm of online content. We have recently notified COTPA Amendment Rules 2023, extending existing regulation to over-the-top media platforms with the objective of curbing the depiction of tobacco products. A reporting portal for online violations has also been launched, ensuring compliance with the country's information technology rules of 2021. We believe that India's OTT rules serves as a beacon of hope offering a blueprint for countries grappling with the complexities of regulating online curated contents. India's approach will not only serve, safeguard the well-being of its citizens, but will also serve to inspire the global community and protect the younger generation from the tobacco epidemic. We remain steadfast in addressing industry interference adhering to Article 5.3 and ensuring that public health decisions remain free from vested interests of the tobacco industry. In conclusion, India remains resolute in its dedication to the WHO FCTC and its objectives. We are ready to collaborate with fellow nations and share experiences as we collectively work towards a tobacco-free world. Thank you, Madam Chair.